What's going on guys? We are back again and we are going to be reviewing a, another Power Rangers amazing show. This was actually the last show that I watched uh, for a long time. I never got into watching any other Power Rangers show after this. I think maybe because I got older and I think I just got out of it for a while and then now that I've been back into watching Power Rangers again and being a Power Ranger fan my whole life I kind of regret not going you know through more Power Rangers and I was too busy caring about what other people thought but overall this season was my last season so this is probably going to be the last review for uh, Power Rangers Down Thunder but Power Rangers Down Thunder man let me tell you it, it was amazing if you guys did not watch Power Rangers Down Thunder you had to be there not only was it the return of just David Frank as Tommy Oliver but at the same time we had got to see real life dinosaurs in this we got to see not real life dinosaurs but you, you guys know what I'm saying we got to see form of dino rangers we got to see the return of tommy becoming a ranger again his life of being a ranger how he became a professor why he became a professor as well and all these other you know villains that we get to meet you know like mezagod and um zeltrax and meaning the white dino ranger you know the drago ranger who he was a pretty cool character as well trent was a cool character um i like the ranger form more than i like i would say the character trent I, for some reason i don't know um, his was kind of very interesting. Um, I will say overall, I liked, uh, again, uh, I think every guy has this. Um, I had a crush on Kira when I was younger. I still love, um, you know, the one that played Kira. Very, not only very attractive, but she, she really brought out an amazing Yellow Ranger and all, right? Very beautiful voice as well. You know, Emma Lahanna, La she did an amazing job as the character. I love the character. I love the powers that they got as well, you know. Kira, she had, you know, the voice, you know, her, her vocals could come out. We had Tommy who had a visibility. We had Connor who had, you know, speed. And we had, of course, um, Trent. He had, um, could walk through walls. We even had, um, you know, uh, oh man, what was his name? I, I know his name. Oh man, Ethan. Um, he had, uh, like armor, almost like armor from, uh, you know, the Triceratops. So that was pretty cool as well. So overall, very cool battles. Uh, I think one of my favorite episodes was when the White Ranger got revealed, as well as also T Tommy finding his previous selves. That was pretty cool. And then, of course, when we got to see the mix-up between the Ninja Storm and Dino Thunder, which was an amazing crossover as well. So I would say, again, Dino, Dino Thunder was probably one of my favorite seasons, not only because of a lot of character growth, but a lot of character design. But also because it was a lot different than I would say the other series or seasons in my opinion. It was a little different. Again, we had a legendary character comeback. We had a lot of cool powers. We had a lot of different types of powers that was being shown as well. And again, this series really brings a lot of, you know, I would say old school fans to the picture. Because Dino Thunder really brought back. Uh, a lot of OG fans that I think were tired of seeing the same thing over and over again that did not get to see any of the original characters that we got to see during, you know, Mighty Morphin or Zero or whatever. And again, I think I can all say that seeing Tommy, you know, morph into the Black Dino Ranger was probably one of the best things I saw, you know, in the damn show. And I think that, you know, seeing these actors and these characters come back off and on throughout the entirety of range of you know ranger history is something to see as well so i'm definitely probably going to see if i can continue the franchise and see maybe if i'm going to go into watching you know more power rangers that i never got to watch i don't know yet that's just it, it may happen it may not i don't know yet but did you guys watch the dino thunder what did you think about it was it good was it bad was it okay was it amazing me personally like i said i loved it i think it was great uh, the intro was fire as well the intro was absolutely amazing i loved it. it's just that rock feeling you know I, I love how it was but overall like i said power rangers down thunder was absolutely amazing that's my opinion what do you guys think please let me know your thoughts down down in the comments down below if you guys are new to the channel subscribe and leave a big fat like on the video if you guys enjoyed and i'll see you as always on the next one